people with high cholesterol levels don't get Alzheimer's. Why don't they get Alzheimer's? Because what does the brain love? Fat. So what's a good cholesterol level? Oh, probably 200, 250. People with high cholesterol don't get Alzheimer's because they're dead already from heart attack or getting a stroke. <laughs> It's true. I have this simple chart here. So this is how it works, you guys. When you have a lot of high cholesterol into your body, this is your blood vessels right here. For example, this is how normal looks. So if we flip it around, this is your blood. Healthy cholesterol levels, the blood flow is going to be good. Someone that has like pretty high is going to look between here and here. And this is called plaque. So when you have a lot of cholesterol into your body, like a lot of LDL, and this is what the one we're talking about today, uh, what happens is it starts creating plaque on the artery walls and then it makes it hard for the blood to get through your arteries and seeing this is when it's really bad here this is where like heart disease high blood pressure all that comes from okay it's simple and, and look see here's here's this like i'm not even a doctor but look effects of high ldl cholesterol you know what I'm saying? Like I've been on a plant-based diet for over 13 years and I'm telling you, I'm not saying you have to stop eating meat. You have to reduce the amount, get your cholesterol into the right place, make sure you're getting a proper amount of cholesterol in your body and you're not overdoing it. Incorporate more healthier carbs, grains, fruits, legumes. These are the foods that you want to incorporate that can reduce heart disease, diabetes, medications, if you got something health related. So if you're someone who's looking for your truth, who's going to actually teach you the way to balance out your diet, or at least get more plant-based foods into your diet so you can reduce your cholesterol levels like you should, go ahead, comment down below plant-based, and I'll reach out to you to help you with that. Peace.